Oh no! Is Michael Saylor selling all his Bitcoin? Oh no! He's gonna crash! He's gonna go to the bottom! What will he ever do? Okay, so you may have seen stuff going on Twitter today that Michael, Michael Saylor, the head of Micro Strategies, that is one of the biggest Bitcoin whales in the world, is selling all his Bitcoin. It's going to go to the bottom. He's portraying us. He was just at the Bitcoin conference saying, do not sell your Bitcoin, but now he's selling. So where is this coming from? Let's switch over to the good old internet here where all things are true. So we have Oz here, CEO of Alt Season, of what is it? CEO of Alt Season Coins and Tokens. He goes, I just realized that MicroStrategy has been selling Bitcoin without telling no one. Michael Saylor said he would never do so, but yesterday he sold more than 1,500 Bitcoins. Now that's a lot of money. Michael Saylor, whenever he buys Bitcoins, he usually announces, he always says he's never going to sell. But according to Oz, the CEO of Alt Season, he's betraying us. He is selling. So let's look at this thread here. Go down here, and then Oz continues to say, From their main address, Bitcoins have been sent to a secondary address that has been using Coinbase and OKEX to sell Bitcoins. Main custodial address, secondary custodial address, um, Although the, although the amount sold yesterday is insignificant compared to other MicroStrategy holdings, selling 63 million worth of Bitcoin is a thing, and since they announced their purchases, they should also announce their selling activities as well. So, on Crypto Banter this morning, they addressed this. Uh, they went into kind of in-depth thing, looking at the wallets, and they actually reached out to Michael Saylor, and this is 100% false. This is not true. Don't panic. He's not selling off his Bitcoin. Uh, the addresses they looked at uh, was not a micro strategy address. So this is not like whatever in the real, real world. Uh, bank account 123 is owned by Michael Saylor. This is people going, looking at these different type of addresses that you can see down here and trying to guesstimate who owns these. So they looked at, oh, Michael Saylor bought so many Bitcoins this day. Oh, this wallet, because you can see everything on the blockchain, this wallet kind of matches up. Uh, but if you go back and to the, the age of that wallet, it was started filling up with Bitcoin well before Michael Saylor um, started having Bitcoin. Now, could it have been his private one? Uh, but if he was hiding all this stuff too, that could get him in a lot of trouble in the real financial world. Uh, but this is not Michael Saylor. He says it's not his account. Uh, people went into more depth about it. So don't worry. MicroStrategy is not selling off all their Bitcoin because that truly would have an effect on the market. The fear and greed index would spike down to fear because uh, Michael Saylor is one of the big cheerleaders for Bitcoin. Buy, 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 buy. Um, don't sell, don't sell. And if he all of a sudden went back on that, it would send a terrible signal to the market. So you can relax. He's not selling his Bitcoin. He still has it all in the bank. He hasn't sold one. So like, subscribe, and we'll see you on the next video. Mm -hmm.